better leader. Three things that you need, either now, between now and TC time, or once you arrive at TC, the things that you need to be a better leader while you're there. And I want you to write those things down as if to say, I need blank to be a better leader. I need and money doesn't count there. All right, no, we're not going to. Food doesn't count. Can you we are going to say, uh, I need this to be a better leader. I'm interested to hear what you might feel like that. Say again? Uh, <laughs> Jacob, what is one way that you can uh, provide support to others? No, that's right, encouragement, right? Good. All right, give support. How are you going to give them support? Absolutely. Yep, good. Somebody else give them another way to provide encouragement. Write them in the notes. Aww, that's sweet. Did you write that a bit? Did you put that down? Aww, write me a note. No, <laughs> now here's the thing. I'm being funny with a manual, but does that make a difference to you when somebody jots you a little note? You weren't expecting it? Yeah, Okay, tell me why. It's a huge thing to get little notes of encouragement. I hope you guys will take a minute today and write one before you leave to somebody who's here. But yeah, write little notes. Thanks for sharing that. That's excellent. All right, somebody else. Another way you can show encouragement to somebody. What do you think? Of, what'd you write down? What, what do you mean? Oh, so giving them some more responsibilities. That's one way to show them encouragement. I think you're right. Again, it elevates someone. Uh, to, yeah, I like that. Good, good, good. Somebody else? What'd you write down? <laughs> she was pointing at you. Yeah, let's go with a white shirt. Yeah, and we take that lightly, but it really makes a difference when somebody gives you some words of affirmation. If you've done something well, good job. That's good. Somebody else? There's another way that... Tell me your first name again. Kitty. Sorry, Kitty. Kitty, have you ever been talking to someone and you're telling them something meaningful to you and they're looking past you and the people who are walking behind you and not listening? Do you remember how that felt? Oh, oh I know. And then, have you ever been the one that is supposed to be listening and you're looking behind someone and then they remind you that you're supposed to be listening to them and you feel about this big? Yep. Yeah. So it means all the difference in the world. Eye contact and pay attention. And guys, you know, listen, here you are, the best leaders in the young Chinese leaders world are right here in this room. And, and we're telling you something that's so simple, like make eye contact, but for some reason we forget to do it all the time. So when you're talking to someone, especially when someone's talking to you about something important, please look at them, Tim. All right, just do it. I think it was more. All right, one more. I need one more encouragement piece. Somebody else. Oh, yeah. That's huge. It's, it's, it sort of defines itself. But don't judge people. You never know what someone is going through back home. You never know if your comment to them today might be the nicest thing anybody has said to them in weeks. And so, man, I, it's that whole idea of walk a mile in someone's shoe before you call them something. Uh, my kids, my wife used to tell my kids, if there was a kid misbehaving in the in the grocery store, you know, our first instinct is to say, what a terrible kid. But the truth is, Tim, are you okay, buddy? You're having some violent outbursts in the bottle. You all right? Do hey, you want to you talk about that or anything? Okay. So to kill that bottle, all right. No, but you want to make sure that you don't cook, cast judgment. That child may have been through a lot that day. Or if you see some mom responding to a crazy kid and going crazy on him, you know, right there in the middle of the store, you think, what a terrible mom. But no, you don't know what that mom is dealing with back home. So, Great point. Tell me your name. Rachel, point of the day today. That was a good one. Thank you for sharing that. Is Don't be judgmental on people. Everybody's was good. That's so, such a powerful one. All right. Three things you need to be a better leader. We're going to wrap it up here.